Now we're going to move into the anterior aspect of the forearm and we're going to look at the superficial layer which involves four muscles. And the first one we're going to talk about is the pronator teres and its origination point is from the medial epicondyle as well as the coronoid process of the ulna because it has a superficial and a deep head. And we do want to remind you guys that the median nerve does pass directly beneath and between those two muscles. So it's often overlooked that when someone has carpal tunnel symptoms down in the hand that you do probably want to check pronator teres as well as the carpal tunnel and it can all the way up the arm as well for sites of compression. But do remember that the median nerve passes right between those two heads of pronator teres. Now for the, uh, for the palpation and muscle test of this one, what we'll do is bring the arm up just a bit like that. And we don't want them to squeeze too hard because that's going to activate a lot of the finger, yeah, all the finger flexors. And now you're getting all kinds of activation across the forearm. If he relaxes those muscles, and now what I'm going to try and do is turn him out, hold there nice and strong, you'll right away see this pronator teres pop up right there. This is the superficial head and it runs all the way to that lateral part of the of the radius and it's what allows you to turn your hand right over into this position here. So the muscle test is out towards supination which again you can see it outlined nicely there.